Well, hey folks, PC7 here. Thanks for joining me as we jump back into Farm Sim 25. Yes, indeed. We are, uh, we are here in Hutan. At, uh, Yolio, Yolio Tractors Sales and Service. We're going to get some uh, wheel weights put on the, uh, the rig here so we can take our plew and go home. So, what do we got here? Uh, sure, we'll fix you up. Dang right, so we'll do that. Alrighty. Paint? Yeah, I don't care. I'm not spending $10,000 to make it pretty. Alright, customize. We need wheels. Uh, what do we got? 160 horse? I don't think we have anything that will exceed that at the moment, so that's fine. But we do want a set of wheel weights thrown in there. So that's 5k. We will, uh, do that yes please okay i've sold back <coughs> excuse me uh, puberty's kicking in i know 66 years old it took its time um i sold that piece of uh, property back for two hundred and seventy-five thousand. so it's we don't have the kit to log so the whole tree thing, yeah, good, we would make money, but, you know, I would rather at this point use some of that money to further our own ventures, i.e., I'd like to get a baler. Well, I'm kind of debating between a baler, like we need a mower, that's a given. We gotta cut grass. We're gonna have goats. The goats eat the grass. We gotta have the grass. I ain't gonna buy grass. So, we need a mower. And I was thinking a baler. Now, the problem is... What's going on here? No reason for that to not hook up. Oh. Is that not the, uh... Sure it is. Well, apparently not though, eh? Alright. No problem. Pick it up. Oh, well. <laughs> All I, I'm an idiot. I'm sorry. All I had to do was look at the blades, and of course they're pointing this way. So unless you want to uh, drive backwards all day, wouldn't have made much sense the other way. There we are. Forgive me. I'm an idiot. It's been however long since I've played. I'll blame it on that. So yeah. Okay, we've got the plow. I'm not going to be doing the plowing. We're going to hit the uh, hit the old hay here pretty quick. But my other option, let's let's have a look here. But it's going to be a little more le a little more or less simple. <clears throat> kind of like me. Jeez. All right, let's jump in here. <clears throat> so, I can go with a baler. Now, balers, we got square around. Um, unless you're going to go with the little mini bales, you're looking at 164000 is the cheapest you can get into that. Ooh, what's on sale? That's the little mini baler. Yeah, okay, so that won't do. Um, or round bales, which I don't have an issue with, we can get into that for 60000 Okay. Now, the other portion of that, of course, is that you've got to have a way to transport it. Yeah. These are our options, and they suck. You got this dolly style for $20,500. Um, yeah. Not a fan. This dolly style for an extra $5,000. Which is half the price of one of these. 
Mm -hmm. Same thing. I mean, the square guy is even more, right? This is a bargain at $50,000. So you're looking at 100 k to buy a baler and this thing, right? All right, let's look at our other option, which is, of course, oh, plus we need a mower, right? So a mower is a mower. I mean, we can spend pretty much as much as we need to on that, right? Um, where are the mowers? Um, ah, right here. So mowers, anywhere from this little front guy, 3.1 meters for 13K. Um, yeah. Don't care about that one. Uh, that's almost 4 meters. And then we've got this. This is actually a mod. Now this is 4.4 .4 meters, but this is the side type, right? So it pokes out the side. Um, 3.4. I'd probably be tempted to either something like that. Um, <clears throat> yeah. Probably this so that we can pop it on the front of the tractor. And for, for this application, if I was to go this way. And then, of course, a... Where are you? Where are you? Where are you? Uh, da, 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 it, we go. A forage wagon. For 30K, this one holds, um, I don't know, whatever 16.1 cubic meters is in, you know, yeah, normal people speaky. So I know it's a fairly small one. It's been in, you know, every farm sim since I think 15. But then you're 77k to get into the bigger one, which would be nicer for sure. Um, 26 compared to, yeah, that's... Well, I mean, it's not double, but it's close enough that you wouldn't care. And I'd much rather get the bigger one to start with. So we'd be looking for a hundred grand, including for the mower and the um, forage wagon, if we went with that one. I mean, obviously much less if we went this way, right? Um, be like 45k and we'd be there. I think we're going to start there. You know that? Yeah. Um, the only other issue I might have, and we'll have to come out of here, and come out of here, and then go shifty P, is... Um, what? What are you doing? I'm not trying to put anything down. I'm just flicking around here to see if they say anything different. Because I want one that holds straw, right? Uh, storage space for hay and straw. Whoa, 60,000. Really? And that's only hay and straw. See, that's the problem. I mean, the grass basically is going to it. So yeah, I think we're going to have to go with uh, the baler and uh, the picker-upper thinger. But for now, let's take our new clue-hoo and go home. We'll take the woodsy way home. It is quite a bit of a shortcut, actually, off the uh, highway route.
It's actually not bad up this hill. Ooh, he says. <laughs> uh, make the corner. There you go. Well, we lost half our speed. 40k to 20. Yeah, there's definitely a speed governor on this thing. Because even down that steep, steep hill, she would not go even a hair over 40k. Ooh, I forgot we had the plow with us. Alright. So... Now, this little field here, I believe, is what we need to start. Oh well, no, it only needs lime. It doesn't need plowing. See, that's something else we need, is a lime spreader. And fertilizer, right? So, yeah. We got a fair bit of kit to get. <laughs> now, have I... Oh, I don't think I've taken the uh, canola out of here yet. No, or whatever it was. Oats, that was it. There we go. So you can see we got all that straw sitting over there. Oh, that's the other thing we need is a wind drawer. They're usually pretty cheap, though, so... You know. I wonder if there's a front one. That would be nice. Are you all gonna fit? Yes. There you go. Look at that. Looky there, man. Alright. Do, do, do. Grab your lance. Makes me want a horse. But I don't want a horse. Although if you do go through all the bother with the training and the riding and the feeding and the watering and all of that, they did sell for pretty good money. The one time I did actually do it in uh, 22. When they first introduced them. What the heck? What have I done? That was weird. Huh. <sighs> Quick, run away. <laughs> All right, pull the pipe in now. We give her a good scrubbing. Yeah, not my favorite place to store our combine, but... 
you do, right? <sighs> well, that's not gonna work. It's taking up enough room for uh, three combiner header trailers. Frankly, so good. Now we can bring this guy in. Close it all up. Because I don't like to leave the header up. You know, that's all hydraulics. Putting that, leaving that kind of weight on the hydraulics probably isn't great. Um, oh, how do you... Oh, right, G to change, right? And then drop it. There we go. Boom. Okay. Last real oh, uh, chore here. Huh, nice is uh, Rice Company. Well, at least you didn't put any thought into it. Um, oh, I didn't realize the backyard's all fenced off. Is there a gate? Can I jump it? No, eh? No, I'm just not capable. It's a nice house. I mean, it's not ours, it's Grandpa's. As far as I know, we gotta, I don't know, sleep in a tractor or something. We'll, we'll figure it out. How's this guy doing? Huh? Huh? He showed me for a moment. Uh, running, running, water, and no key. 177, oyster, 87. Okay. Very good, very good. And there you are. So. different crops. Where's the wall? Oh, I see. Okay. Still not going to be on that side of it. Eh, I suck. There we go. Well, that's what I wanted to do. Took me bloody long enough. I just wanted to be on this side of the stairs. <laughs> okay. Hey, Green Paw. I think we're done for the day, dude. I think we are done for the day, so we know how those are doing. Now these, these require plowing, don't they? No? Hmm. Okay. I'll have to look that up. Maybe you don't do rice twice. Or like, or maybe, 
Maybe you do do rice twice. Just never mind. You know what I mean. Maybe you don't have to plant it every season. Huh. Or maybe it doesn't change the uh, info until tomorrow. Yeah, our property ends right at this road. Now, the one that I thought probably had even more grass was actually this one. Let's have a look. Because that's the one that we had, right? And it continues on down the hill, as this one does. So, yeah, 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 yeah. See, if we look at this, here's 33. Right, so it's pretty much we're almost at the edge of it now. So down along here, it's all of this. Uh, all of this. This is a fair bit of grass. Yeah, all the way to the end. So all of that, plus, again, some woods. And this one is $85,000 cheaper. Hmm. Well, we'll see. What we're going to do now is we're going to uh, change it all over. I have set the days to 7 per month. But it doesn't take place until next month. And since you can't set it until you're actually in-game, I don't think there is actually a choice. You know what I mean? Like, no matter what you do, your first day is just that. It's going to be one day, one month. Boom. On with life. So, <clears throat> I have a feeling that the crop that's in that field won't be there tomorrow. But we'll see, you know. Maybe it, uh, what in God's name is that? Yeah, you're that fixed, man. Seriously, don't look at me like that. It's like a fire hazard. Okay. Let's, uh, let's do this. Eight of, yeah. You guys are funny, eight of six o'clock man all right it's a new day <sighs> crocodile noob or whatever roosters say Whew, bit of a frog out here today nice nice morning mist makes it look all mist Ickle? <laughs> See what I've done there, man? Alright, here we are. Copious, gracious goodness. You evil. You evil. Alright. Yeah, grass, grass, grass. For our soon to be goats, goats, goats. Yes. I think I can take 19 of them in there or something. Okay, we've still got this. It's fine. Needs lime and it's got small weeds. Well, that's fine. That's just fine and dundy. Oh, this is still here. Withered, yeah. <laughs> okay. See, that's the sort of thing I was afraid of. I don't know why he didn't harvest his crop. I haven't checked contracts. Maybe we have it turned on so that we're supposed to do everything. That's uh, too bad for them. Alright. So, obliviously, today, we need to uh, pick up this ha-ha straw. So. Um, don't 
don't know that I need to windrow this, to be honest. Let's have a look at uh, what our choices are. Seven meters. That's pretty biggish, actually. Um, well, kind of not really. Ninety one thousand dollars. Are you goofy? Oh, here we go. I kind of like that. So we might be able to pop a couple of rows together. Sure. Uh, details? Yeah, I think that'll look good in a farm. I think we can use that. Okay. Now, we have a uh, mower, yeah, but fine. Round baler, square baler. I'm going to go round baler. We're going to get the guile. Uh, round bale net, standard net. Film binding, empty. Hmm. Hmm. Do I need that? I guess I need something, eh? Otherwise I have to buy it. All right, well, 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 whatever. <laughs> okay. All right. And then, of course, is the transporter of it. So... That'll do. Okay. Um. That should do it. Let's head off and grab the uh, rower since there's no delivery. <laughs> not something we have in the game yet. We'll have to wait for the uh, ever amazing modders to decide they want to do that. Now it's September. Let's have a look at... I don't imagine there's much. Well there is actually, isn't there? So we could plant canola. We could plant barley and we could plant wheat. Hmm. Grass or oil seed, but like who cares? So canola, not of much use to us. Wheat or barley, though, we can plant. So we'll have to have a look at that. Oh, the other thing we need, of course, is going to be... Uh, a sprayer for lime and fertilizer. Should be running like a top. We just had her all tuned up. Now I've got gas usage set on high, so if there's any chance they're actually gonna, you know, go through the gas, this should be it. Or diesel, sorry, whatever. 
Um, yeah, fuel usage. Let's just say it like they do. I have the fuel usage set to high. Probably gonna suck on the combines, but probably a little more realistic on the tractors, because, you know, it seems on normal settings you can, like, go literally for seasons without having to fuel up. And I'm pretty sure that isn't right. Even if you have a big tank, there's a reason. It's because it takes big drinks. Okay, don't want to roll over his crop. Coming through. this through the woods. It's got pretty small tires on it. And it sticks up pretty high too. Yeah, I think we're going to have to go around with this one. Hopefully it's not too much longer a route. There it is. Uh, I think this is the one we want. Dang, I don't know. Uh, yeah. Come on, giddy up. Let's just set the cruise control. Oh, it looks like a lot of crops are withering. I wonder if that is because of the way the contracts are set up. Because that definitely looks like more withered crop there. Huh. There we are, we're climbing up out of the fog anyway. Ooh, that's steep. <laughs> Whoa. Oh yeah. We're really living top of the hill up here, let me tell ya. Yeah, it'll do too. Looks like... You don't have access to this land? What the heck are you talking about? What? What? What do you mean I don't? Oh no! What? too bright. Really? 
You don't have a lot of uh, good space to park stuff, do we? Whoa. Okay, this thing's a little bit twitchy. That's too close. Let's try that one a little farther over. There we go. Jeez. Gotta be so careful. This thing's really twitchy, man. Really twitchy. Okay. Goodly enough way. Hmm. So what does this field say now? Crop type rice. Huh. I don't get it. Rice fields, so you can read the build mode menu, okay. Alright. Okay. Well, they're not yet flooded. doesn't say anything about Okay, we have that cedar it doesn't say much about when you do that, though, does it? Launching, rolling. Hmm. So, this rice, which is the one you flood for, can be planted in April and May. Um, Already been flooded. Hmm. Well, I don't know. Doesn't really seem to update, does it? Well, occasionally it says harvested, like there. Harvested 50%. Yeah, growth harvested. Okay.
so oh well no wonder I wanted to turn the stone off yeah that I went on that I went on that's on okay yeah crop destruction and stones I didn't want on oh Needs plowing. Okay, that's kind of what I thought. My fault. Entirely. Oh, oh, oh look what we have. Ooh. Okay, we're gonna need, um... I don't know where we're gonna put them. Um, hmm. We really do need some sort of useful, usable shed, you know that? Nothing big, I just need a small shed. 44,000? Are you? No, okay, here we go. <laughs> Please don't tell me that's the cheapest freaking shed you have. Um, store vehicles and tools. How big is it? Okay, it's pretty small. Cool. Uh, 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 uh. What's this? Oh, that's way too big. Those are those. Okay, that's not too terribly big. I just, basically, all I want is a little shed that, uh, what's it overlapping with? I don't think there's anything actually there. Huh. Um. If I put it in free mode, I can put it just about anywhere I want. Which is a much better deal. Hmm. Only problem is... Okay, yeah, that is quite... Uh, Quite a dip. I can see why it might be having issues. I put it there. Hmm. Oh, that's a good spot. That's a good spot. Doesn't overlap with anything. Um, go back to free place. There we go. Oh, is that backwards? It is. Whew. That was close. Okay. Perfect. Perfect.
Jeez, what the heck? Okay, that's not good. Jeez. There we are. I think I had it a little too, uh, a little too close to the ground. <laughs> Alright, now. Let's go there. Am I on the wrong side of the road? I mean, I'm not saying that's not possible, you know? I don't know. Yikes. <laughs> I'm an idiot and I don't care. <laughs> This thing's darn near as fast as the... Big white. Yeah, same with this thing. Even full throttle down a hill is will not exceed its thirty eight kilometer limit. I suppose that's a good thing. I mean otherwise, you know, you'd be Dropping transmissions and rear ends and differentials and what other sort of gear was, you know, between the engine and the moving parts of the vehicle. You'd be shedding things like crazy. There we go. Oh, I was going to leave the dummy. I was actually going to leave the loader arms on and pick up a pallet fork, but we'll not be doing that. Um, yeah, I'm not really here for either of these, and I should have put the weight on the front. Oh crap! Well, I mean, I will take one with me. They don't want to be listening to that the whole time I'm here. Hello. So we kind of figured on this one, eh? 3.4 meters. Oh, but that's if I'm going to was going to use the other thing. Um, if I'm going to windrow it and bail it, it doesn't matter, does it? We can go this guy at 3.9. That's almost half a meter bigger. Or for 18, 4.4. Hmm, now we're talking. Still, uh, yeah. Yeah, let's use this one. <clears throat> um, a tinkin is what we want. Sure. All right. Alrighty then. Now hopefully, without a weight on the back, we'll actually be able to get home. Now, does this one stand straight up when you pick it up? Is this what's about to happen? Or does it just stick out there like a big tail? Huh, I think it just sticks straight out the back. 
Alright, I still seem to have ground control here. Um, yeah. Let's, uh, let's do the thing. I have to be a little careful going through the woods so we don't bounce it off a tree, but other than that, I think we'll be fine. As long as we can get up those hills. And this tractor feels like it's pretty torquey. It seems to have a lot of bottom end grunt to it, so we'll see how it does. I mean, it's brand new as well, so... It's got, you know, 0.1 hours on it. Yeah, find the gear. And into four high we go. Woohoo! This fog would lift. So I do. I didn't actually mean to step down here, but okay. So we've got a little strip around here, not much. Yeah. Uh, same down here, not much. It's still growing, eh? Wow, that's a big field. A big field. And straight into bushes. Hmm. Man, it's a shame about that field. That sucks. Almost makes me want to borrow 100k, buy the field, pick the straw up, sell the field, put the 100k back in the bank and call her a day. <laughs> oh, man. Hmm. <sighs> So, 219. 
18, we need 275. Let's go get our bailer. Boy, I wish there was store delivery. <laughs> Yeah, that's what I'm gonna do. We'll uh, grab our straw off it. And then we'll resell the field. I was just so anxious to get that other one in before the night fell because I knew that the crops wouldn't be there the next day. I thought they'd harvest them though. I didn't think it was just gonna wilt off. Seems a bit harsh. Alright. That's quite the field, eh? Wow. They said there's no big fields. I think everybody was looking at the American map and going, mm -hmm. It's America. Fields should be big. Well, you know. I'm sure that most of the big, most of the American farms have gone completely industrial, but I'm sure there's more than a few that, you know, proper farmers who uh, aren't buying 100,000 acre properties. You know, all they can afford is a thousand acres and they gotta get every, every root and fruit they can out of it. Geez, I think this is the first piece of kit we're taking home that's uh, not green. Alright, we have a go wild there. Um, okay, it's got netting on board. Alright. Hopefully we don't run out. We'll have to buy more if we do, obviously. But, uh, so that's a new thing. Kind of nice to see them adding a little bit more detail, as it were. So, uh, yeah. Cool. I know what I forgot to do. I forgot to go in and enable the console. It's still the same process as it was in 22. You go into your game file. And you change where it says developer from false to true. That's all. Simple dimple. You, you... I'm not sure if you need, like, notepad or something, notepad plus plus to open it or whatever. I just always have that on my computer, so it always opens it. But it might open up with whatever Windows has built in. I have no idea. I've been running notepad plus plus since... XP? I'm not sure they had it for 98 SE. Ooh, come on, baby. So we were making 20k through there with just the tractor. Pulling the baler, it took us down to 12k. So there you go. There's definitely some compensation for the weight of that trailer. Oh, look at that. I briefly hit 41k. Did you see that? You didn't. Well, you won't believe me because it'll never <laughs> happen again. But yeah, just for just for that millisecond, we hit 41k. Again, because of weight, I guess. I'll have to try it with something like a, you know, 30,000 
cubic meter trailer or something full of something light like concrete. Let's see if then we can do, you know, 42k down a steep hill. <laughs> Alright. Tell me I don't have access to this field. Ah, oh, slap you silly. Oh, I was gonna windrow it first, wasn't I? Yes. So. Let's briefly drop the baler there. Go grab the rower of wind. Weird thing to call it. Boy, this is getting pretty crowded pretty quickly. Alright. Nice wide turn so we don't drag our cultivator out into the middle of the field. Look both ways, ignore whatever you see, and carry on. Alright, here we go. We've been here before. Yes, we have. Oh, yes, we have. Whoa. And ah, whoosh, whoosh, whoosh. Oh, look, you're letting me go here. How nice of you. Easy peasy, two of them. <laughs> yeah. There we go. Oh. That's a, <clears throat> a please don't fall down there kind of hill. That's what that is. Alright, I don't know that I'm going to catch all of this on the way through. In fact, I think what I'm going to do at this point. Okay. So I'm gonna go around and do the headland just like I did with the, uh... Oh, crap. Okay. I'm afraid it was being a bit of... Yeah, it's really hard to just get a nice smooth line going on with this thing. Alright, let's try that out. And I'm just going to go straight across here. There we go. Alright, good stuff. Good, kind of got all of it. <laughs> right on. Right on. And same thing here. We're going to do a single headland just to clean up the end mess. Mary and Miss. What? Sure. We'll pretend that's exactly what we wanted to do. Mm. 
Hmm. That's a weird one, isn't it? So let's do the easy ones first. Ooh, these ones might be too far apart. So we'll go here. Yeah, it makes a little more sense from this end. A little. It's still going to get a little bit odd at the end there, but it's okay. It'll all get picked up, made into square things. I think what I need to do, there's just one more by the look of it. Uh, well, kind of. Kind of. That should do. I have no idea how long I've been on here. Starting to feel like we're probably getting to that point though, aren't we? I think I'm going to put the gear out here. The nice maneuverable tractors can go and tuck into the back corners and stuff. No, no, you don't. Try and pay some attention to what you're doing. to push around. Alright, close enough. Cool. Okay. Okay. Does it require unfolding? No. Alright, so all we should have to do is turn it on and lower the pickup and uh, call it a day. Day. Alright, so. Let's do that. Turn it on. Lower the little brushy bit. Not bad. Seems to have a pretty good, uh, pretty good sweep on it. You know, I mean, 
yeah, there's little bits we're gonna miss, obviously, because my wind rowing is far from superb. Alright, now. Oh, I can turn on automatic drop, eh? Interesting. Oh, stop rolling, dude. Okay, there it is. Close her back up. Carry on. Oh, crap. I'm missing quite a bit of it there. Let's hope it doesn't roll down the hill. Nope. Place is a perfect one. Can't actually feel it pop off the back like you could in 22. Like you always felt that kind of clunk clunk as it came off the baler. Well, we'll get used to it. We'll get used to it. Looks like we got rain coming in. Yeah, no indicator at all. That's unfortunate. I always used that 1022 to know uh, when I could close her back up and carry on. Oh, don't get too close to that edge. <laughs> it won't take you long to get to the bottom, but you won't be happy when you get there. Just pop it out. Boy, that net's gonna last a while, eh? 
we barely touched on you. We've only dropped four or five bales, but yeah, that's well, good. That's well, good. It's a couple hundred bucks. We used to get it for free. There you go, eh? Giants just trying to nickel and dime us to death again. <laughs> I'm off that giant steep hill? Yeah, I think so. Oh, stop! I'm letting you out. There, you are free. Goodness. Okay, I don't think we left too much. You know, there might be a little blob here and there, but other than that, pretty happy with it. Mm -hmm. Yeah, there's a little bit there. I think there's a tiny bit up at the top. Uh, over there. And where else did we miss some? Here. Alright. That's, uh... Okay. Well, well. We have some bales. There we go. So, we're going to have to go back into town, of course, to get our, uh, whatchamacallit there, um, better baler picker-upper, and, uh, we'll also grab the mower. What did we get? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven bales? Not bad. Not bad. And then, of course, we have this, uh, huge field. I wouldn't mind getting a bunch of the grass cut before I decide whether we want to... Oh, there's another bale. So, eight bales. Um, before we decide if we want to uh, quickly resell it back off. Because there is all of that. I mean, a lot of this is going to be just brutal. But, once you get below this little ridge, that whole patch there. That'll make a fair chunk, you know. So, whoops. <laughs> oh well. See, so yeah, I'm one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Good enough. And that's going to do it, I think, for this one, guys. So, hope you enjoyed. If you did, please remember to hit that like button. It does help out. And uh, for those of my old viewers that watch the old Farm Sim series, thanks for coming back for this one. It looks like it's going to be pretty interesting. Take care of each other, folks. Hit the like buttons. Blah, blah. Ciao for now. A little quick there, aren't you? Carry on. <laughs> I'm such a...